So if you actually look at it, all the nerve issues is coming from an impingement issue. If you take a look at this wire right here, so for example, this is the nerve and it supplies, for example, this area of my body or this area of my body. If the nerve is compressed here, something is being compressed here. You have to get rid of that compression for you to free up that nerve. So what you can do is, so the solution for nerve issues or nerve pro problems is to free up that compression or that cause. So if it's from the low back, it could be your disc that is causing this one. So if it's a <laughs> disc herniation, it's causing compression on the nerve or on the nerve root. Could also be coming from an intervertebral foraminal compression, meaning the spaces on your low back is shortened or got smaller. That's why it's causing also compression on the nerve. If it's from the hips or piriformis, the piriformis muscle is tight and it's compressing the sciatic nerve like this. So relax this one, free this one up so that that nerve can uh, supply the se its sensory functions properly again. What you can also do is try to mobilize the nerve, which I will explain much in much more detail on the exercise on the exercise section of this video series or this video content so if it's compress compressing here there's actually two solutions so one is remove the compression so remove this one by doing some exercises or some manual therapy treatments or what you can also do is mobilize the nerve meaning move that nerve away from the compression so it can be healthy once again so i'll teach you some nerve mobilization exercises just in case your foot symptoms is coming from a nerve issue rather than your plantar fasciitis